Hey guys, it's Brandon, AKA Be Rich Beauty, AKA your beauty best friend. Beauty besties, we're talking about mermaid inspired skin today. Uh-huh, we're going under the sea, eh, and we're making our skin look glowy and juicy. So, you know what to do. Grab your beverage, let go. Besties, most importantly, what you sipping on? Ooh, this glass got a water spot on it. Child, don't judge me. I am drinking rose. I feel like we're winding down to the end of summer. And before all you pumpkin spice latte folks, go ahead and start making it feel like fall around these parts. I said I am sipping on the last days of summer with my rose. So, cheers to you, sugar. And before we jump into this mermaid inspired skin today, for all the new beauty besties, welcome on in. While you're here though, don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notifications so you don't miss out on all this good old melanated magic sugar. If all the beauty besties is not new to this, but you are what? True to this? Y'all know I love seeing y'all. Welcome back into the room, sugar. Now, you know, ever since we went down under the sea this summer with Ariel from The Little Mermaid, AKA Haley Bailey, Mermaid core trend, and y'all can Google it, mermaid core trend has been a thing between mermaid eyes, mermaid skin. So I said, you know what, let's talk about this trend. It can be called water glow, it can be called mermaid skin. Um, but I decided to bring out some, some products that I love in order to bring this to life. One, y'all know I use this often. This is the um, Hyper Real Ceramizer by MAC. And then also, hello, we're bringing this into play today, the new Studio Radiance Serum Powered Foundation by MAC as well to create some glowy skin. Now, I know you're probably thinking, but beauty bestie, your skin is skinning. <laughs> it is, but I... <laughs> what? It is skinning. Um, I, I looked at myself in the camera and I said, okay, glow. So I said, you know what? Let me just show you guys what I used to prep my skin before I started filming. Obviously, you know I cleanse first, but I use this Watermelon Glow Hyaluronic Clay Pore Type Facial, which is a pore refining and exfoliator by Glow Recipe. It looks like this. I show you guys how to do this and how to use it on my Instagram. I did a get ready with me before I started filming, so go ahead and check that out if you wanna see what this looks like. And then I followed up this once I rinsed it off with the Watermelon Glow PHA and BHA Pore Tight Toner by Glow Recipe. Y'all know I love a good BHA, AHA, all that great jazz. So I used this to um, as my toner right when I took the mask off and then I followed it with my normal skincare routine. But I also made sure I depuffed my face using my Be Rich Beauty Gua Sha. I gave myself a little bit of a facial massage right through here and down into the neck area. And then I also utilized my Be Rich Beauty, uh-huh, Be Rich Beauty face roller as well. Is this a shameless plug? Hell yeah, because this is how I keep my face looking tight, looking right. And if you wanna buy either one of these, they come in this set and it is in the link. It's, excuse me, it's in the description box of this video. You can click the link and get you the onyx or the rose quartz. But you know, I had to prep and help with the circulation and the blood flow and the depuffing before I had to come on camera today. And what it's giving it's glowing, no tea, no shade though. That watermelon tightening, pore refining, blah, 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 blah. It's a lot of words, y'all. Has my pores really smooth and tight and I'm glowing. So let's jump into this actual makeup because I know y'all are tired of hearing me talk. Of course, you're never tired of hearing me talk. That's why I love you. So the key for creating mermaid skin is to make your skin look wet and juicy, but you don't want to look like you just got caught in the rain or you just got, you know, the, the water bucket challenge on you. You want to make sure that you have the hydration and the dewiness and the juiciness in the right area. So I'm going to literally use the Hyper Real Ceramizer along with the Studio Radiance Serum Power Foundation together, but I'm going to actually do a little bit of matte right down the bridge of my nose and right on the corners of my nose as well to try to control the shine so it can be deliberate for the actual glow we're about to layer in. Grabbing a little bit by MAC, the MAC Prep and Prime Skin Refine Zone. Y'all know I love this. This is literally like a liquid powder in a tube. I'm gonna grab just a little and go right through here. And I'm gonna tap, tap, tap because I want to easily absorb rather quickly. Tap, tap, tap. But I actually gonna tap, tap, tap this hot spot right here. You guys can see it instantly went matte. I'm telling you, if you don't use this, this is like the best thing to also keep 
in your uh, workout bag, your purse, your travel bag, all of that great jazz, the bag on the plane, because this is literally, you can take this and you can even apply it on top of makeup. And all you gotta do is tap and it won't disturb your makeup, but it'll instantly make you matte in those areas. So I've mattified my face in the areas I need. Taking the Hyper Real Ceramizer, using my hands, I'm gonna ceramize the high planes here. I'm gonna tap. I'm just gonna pull it under my brow. You can pull it up above the brow if you need to. Tap, tap, tap. So you want just this light glow, like so. You can even do a little through here if you want to, just to give yourself some glow. It's skincare, why not? I'm gonna use a lighter color underneath and around my eye area just to brighten me up because I wanna keep it glowy. And I'm just gonna take that brightness through here. And we're gonna pull it up. So I'm using one of the foundations like a concealer. And because it's super hydrating, it's not settling into fine lines. So you can see we're bringing that glow in just like that. And what I love about this trend is because it's, you know, hydration, your skin's gonna love you. If you're oily like me, all you gotta do is mat down the areas where you know you get really, really, really oily, like I did in the beginning. And then, you know, we'll mat down those areas with a little bit of powder at the end as well. But look at that glow, look at that brightness. And then I'm grabbing my complexion color and we're doing that and pulling that up into the lighter color here. Have you guys got a chance to play with this foundation yet? Let me know in the comment. As you can see, the coverage for this is a straight up medium and it looks good. And I don't know if you guys saw my little unboxing for this. Again, this helps to improve, improve, excuse me, the skin hydration level by 209%, but it has hyaluronic acid, which we know is great for the skin, by the way, 10% hyaluronic acid in the foundation, by the way. And then also jojoba and olive oil, which helps to condition the skin. I mean, <laughs> the skin is skinning today. Catch it. Look at this glow, baby. So now what I'm gonna do is, ooh, I think I'm gonna go a little bit brighter now that I got my face on and cover up some of these blemishes, honey. Let's just add a little bit more brightness through here. And because it's a skin look, we're not gonna do much today, but I am gonna do a little bit of an eye. A little light, light contour, cause who would I be if I didn't give myself just a little bit of sculpting? Hi, hello. We're going outside today. Grab your powder, whether it's pressed, whether it's translucent, whether it has a little bit of color. Y'all know I'm obsessed with this Pro Blur powder. Taking just a pinch of roux and right on the corners of the nostrils, we're gonna tap just to, uh-huh, like that. So that way we have just enough matte and right through the center because everybody gets like oily through here. So we really wanna knock that shine down just a little. I told you we were keeping it simple, a nice dark black and brown liner going right into my waterline. Teddy eyeliner, y'all know I love a good Teddy. Right underneath the lash line. And just a little on top. Taking my finger, I'm just smudging it. You do the same on the bottom with your finger or a brush. Doesn't have to be perfect. I don't want it to be perfect. That's exactly what I want. If you make it messy, grab a little bit of your concealer and just clean it up. But this is what I wanted for the eye, like so. Taking Pleasure Principle Dazzle Glass by MAC. Ooh, yes. Because again, Mermaid, I want that three-dimensional sh shimmer sparkle. I love that this has like a blue pearl in it. We're doing that all over. Add a liner if you feel like it. You know what, I'm gonna add a liner. I don't know why I was playing. Plum lip pencil. Mm-hmm, like so. I'm gonna curl my lash. I feel real fancy today. Same lip gloss. You know what, let's do a little of that on the lid. And you can just tap that in like this three-dimensional shine and sparkle and glossiness. Cause again, it's mermaid, which I think. 
And because we smudged out the teddy, it's cute, right? Grab a little mascara, darling. Go back with a little bit of ceramizer as we finish with that same brush that we used for our Studio Radiance. And we're just gonna tap in a little bit more of that glow right through here. See that? Ooh, yes, darling. Right there. And bam, it's the skin for me. It's the Mermaid Core Water Glow Skin. And the skin is skinning. It's saying, you wanna add a little bit of blush, you got a little bit of blush. And I'm saying that I look like I'm related to Ariel. I'm saying that even though it's hot as Hades outside in Miami, I still can have a deliberate glow and just keep the center matte. The skin looks good. The skin looks bouncy. The skin looks juicy. The lips are juicy. It's all about bringing that juicy, bouncy glow to the face. You can even get a little fancy, and I'm gonna tell you something. Gloss in the eyes is a commitment, child. It doesn't last long, but if you need a moment, to, a say something moment and a say something eye, you can do a little gloss in the eye, real cute. Don't go outside too long because it'll start to drip and melt. But you know what I'm saying? I'm giving y'all inspirations, okay? Cause that's what your beauty best friend does. And on that note, guys, I got to go. You know what to do. Subscribe to the channel, like this video if you like, and leave me a comment. Most of all, you check the notifications and make sure they're turned on so you don't miss out on all this good old glowy melanated magic sugar. Who loves you? <laughs> I do. See you next time. Bye.